Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Owning Life PT. My name is John. I'll be your instructor today. Please remember, this is a workout class. Always work within your own limits, and if you experience pain throughout any exercise, stop that exercise immediately and simply wait for the next one. Um, this workout is not a competition. Always work within your own limits. Even though we're doing a stretching class, always work within your own limits. I will demonstrate the stretches. Please do them along with me to help speed up the class. Key points to remember throughout everything in life. Shoulders back and down, neck long and flat, chin tucked. Soft on the knees and try and find neutral pelvis by rocking the hips forward and back. So we're just gonna start with a nice little warm up and then start stretching the whole body ankles all the way up. So just jump up and we'll start with a bit of a knee rotation and then jogging on the spot. So knees and feet hip width apart, hands come onto the knees and we just go whoop de whoop. So we're warming up the ankles, the knees, and the hips. Let the ankles rotate, let the knees come down and all the way up. Change directions, down and up. You can hear the ankles rolling around, that's good. Coming up to standing, feet hip width apart. It's gonna do spine rotation. So soft on the knees, bum tucked under, hands come out in front. Inhale through the nose, exhale. Twist and round and look through the other side of the body. Inhale, hands to the front, exhale. Twist around. So maintain soft knees. Pretty much doing Tai Chi. Try and twist through the body. Eyes look around to the back of the room. Two more. Beautiful, start jogging on the spot. Push up through the ankles. High low on the ankles. Lift the legs up a little bit higher. Swing the arms forward and back. Facing the side of the room, we're gonna do some reverse lunges. So balancing on one foot, and then lunge backwards as far as you can go, and then stretch down, stretch the hip flexors. Push back up through the heel, swapping sides, reverse lunge, and then stretch down, swapping sides. Keep going, I'm just going to turn the side pad down. Right, oh, so reverse lunge and then stretch. Reverse lunge, it's up there, mate, and then stretch. Two more. And then jogging on the spot. Coming to standing, feet hip width apart. We're just going to take one hand at a time and do a little side reach. Inhale, come back up. Exhale, swap sides. Soft on the knees, bum tucked under slightly. Two more. 
Chuyên ngô. Interesting. Coming down to the mat, we're going to start stretching now. So the first one, we just come into a little step, one foot laying flat on the ground. The other one comes pushing up onto the ankle, yeah? So in this position, you can dig your finger into the joint of the ankle. Roll the ankle around a little bit. Now we're going to stretch it. So push forward, come to the big toe and dorsiflex the foot. You'll feel it pulling behind the, the arch. You can give the arch a bit of a warm up pull. You can feel the tension from the big toe all the way through the arch. Push back up as high as we can. Push, 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 push. Wearing high heels. Sink back down. Inhale. Exhale. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Push all the weight onto that foot. One more time. Push up through the toes. Activate the calf. Sink back down. Inhale. Exhale. Stretch. So just push up and do a few rotations through the ankle. Change directions. And swapping sides. So we're coming to a semi little step. First we just work our finger into the, the joint. Feel it crunching and carrying on. Now we dorsiflex, dig the toe into the ground and come up a little bit and stretch out the big toe. Push away from the mat, activate the calf, come up as high as we can. Sink back down, stretch. Dorsiflex as hard as we can. Put all your weight onto that big toe. Push up through the calf. Come right up onto the toe. And sinking back down. Inhale. Exhale. Stretch. Let's do a few rotations here. Change directions. Beautiful. So come and sit on both feet this time. Going to stretch out the, the quads a little bit. So knees and feet hip width apart. Bum sits through onto the mat. Then slowly come backwards onto the elbows. So only go as, as low as you can go with your body's posture. If you're staying here, that's comfortable, that's okay. So wherever position you're in, activate the glutes, push the pubic bone towards the ceiling. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Squeeze the glutes, push the pubic bone to the ceiling. Lowering back down. Inhale, exhale, if you can, go a little bit lower. So you might be right down on your elbows now. On the exhale, push the bum towards the ceiling, activate the glutes, push, push, push. Sinking back down. One last time, you might be fully on your back. Legs, you might be, but you might not be. So take the bum, activate the glutes, push the pubic bone towards the ceiling. Push, 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 push. And relax. Inhale. Exhale. Stretch. Pushing back up. 
coming out of this position, come into a standing position. So we're just going to not do a nice big deep squat. We'll work on the ankles again. So feet hip width apart, bum tucked under. Inhale, come down nice and low until we come back onto the toes again. One last stretch. You can wiggle the bum around, but we're trying to dorsiflex the big toe, yeah? Can rock forward and back on the ankles. Beautiful. Coming into a seated position. Feet together, knees into a diamond, yeah? So let's breathe deep into the belly a few times like we're doing yoga. So inhale through the nose, puff out the belly a little bit. Exhale, belly sinks down. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. So one hand comes behind the body. The other hand goes onto the knee and pushes it down to the ground. Push, 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 push. So we're stretching the adductors and the hip flexors slightly. Inhale, fill the belly. Exhale, push, push, push. Inhale. Exhale, push, push, push. And swapping sides. Opposite hand comes behind the body. Other one comes to the knee. Inhale, fill the belly. Exhale. Push, push, push. Inhale. Exhale, push, push, push. Beautiful, coming into a hamstring stretch. One foot comes up into 45, the other one out straight. Take the body and slightly face the hamstring. Inhale, exhale, lean forward and try and grab your toes. Back nice and straight, leaning through from the hips. So if you can't quite grab your toes, we're going to do a little exercise. And first off, we're going to pull the toes towards us. So pull, 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 dig the calf into the mat. Push the toes away, push, 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 activate the calf. Neutral. Inhale, exhale. Stretch. You that tighten the legs, Leah. One more time, pull the toes towards us, dig the calf into the mat, pull, pull, pull. Push, 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 push the calves away, point the toes. Neutral, inhale, exhale, lean forward through the hips. And resting, swapping sides. One foot cocked up into 45. One out nice and straight. Can push pull with that calf to get it activated. Then take the body and face the leg we're stretching. Bending through the lower spine, not through the shoulders like this. We want to keep the back nice and straight. Bend through the hips. So first we'll pull the calf towards us. Pull, pull, pull. Push, push, push. Neutral. Stretch. First one, pull, pull, pull the calf towards us. Pull the toes towards us, dig the calf into the mat. 
Feel the pain. Push, push, push. Push through the toes. Reach away from the body. Neutral. Inhale, exhale. Stretch. Beautiful. Coming out. Come lay onto your back. We'll start in the lower back a little bit. <sighs> Neck long, flat, chin tuck, shoulders tucked under. Imprinted spine, legs come up into tabletop. Take the left leg and kick it to straight. Hands reach out beside the body. Inhale through the nose. Maintain the knees together. Hips can come off the mat, but lower the leg down towards the right, towards the bent knee that's in 90. Come out about halfway. Pause. Push the hands into the mat. Inhale through the nose. Exhale. Lower a little bit more. Remember, knees stay locked together. Pause. Inhale. Exhale. Try and lengthen from the hips to the rib cage on the top side. Pause one more time. Inhale. Exhale. Beautiful. Hold the stretch. One big deep breath. And on the exhale, squeeze the glutes, the core. Draw the knees back to vertical. Nice and slow, push the lower back into the mat, protect it. Couple of big deep breaths into the belly. Swapping sides, right leg comes up nice and straight. Hands spread out, hold the body straight. We're trying to lengthen from the rib cage to the top hip. So inhale through the nose. Exhale, lock the knees together and let the body fall away towards the side of the room, twisting from the hips to the rib cage. Pause. Inhale through the nose. Exhale. Keep twisting through the lower spine. Pause, inhale, exhale, lengthen from the rib cage to the hips, let the body twist around, pause one more time, lengthen from the hips to the rib cage, if you're fully on the mat that's okay, but try and keep stretching from the ribs to the hips. On the next exhale, squeeze the glutes, the pelvic floor, the core. Draw the knees back up into tabletop. Hold tabletop, force the lower back into the mat. Rock the hips side to side a little bit. And then hug the knees, curl up ribs to hips. Wrap around the knees. Pull both towards the chest. The more you breathe in, breathe out, relax the mind, forget about everything outside the stretching class. Concentrate on your hips, squeezing and pushing against your thigh bone. Roll around, come into our three stretches that will improve the hip mobility. So come up onto the knees, body's in a straight line. Come into a semi-lunge. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, push forward. You'll feel it right up on top here because we stretched out the quads. You'll feel it right near the hip joint.
Beautiful. Push back up a bit and try and get ankle to bum. If you can't quite get ankle to bum, that's okay. Just keep stretching forward in this position. If you've got ankle to bum, exhale, pull, pull, pull. Both Jody and Leah are quite tight still on the on the head quads. Pull, 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 inhale, relax. Exhale, pull the ankle to the bum. Letting go with the ankle. Lengthen through the leg a little bit, let it stretch out. A little bit more, that's it, perfect. So you can move this other leg to the side a little bit. Come in, both hands onto the mat. You can lift the knee up off the mat with the toes. Get a good warrior lunge. See this, Leah? Yeah, beautiful. Good lunge. Knee comes to the side out of the way. Two hands on the mat. Last one. Have a little stretch. Bounce. And come in out. Knee come, ankle comes back in. Push back up. Come into a standing on our knees. Swap inside, come into a semi little lunge. Take the bum, tuck it under with the hips and then push forward. Inhale, exhale. Pushing back up straight a little bit. If you can, ankle comes to the bum. If not, just stay in that stretch position. So once you grab your ankle, grab it with two hands if you like, or one hand, pull the ankle towards the bum. On the exhale, kick the hand, kick the foot into the hand, kick, 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 kick. Relax, inhale. Exhale, stretch, 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 stretch. <sighs> Letting go of the ankle, let the leg come back to the mat. Walk the knee back a little bit, come a little bit deeper. Both hands come on one side, walk the knee across a little bit. So we're coming into a massive little low warrior stretch. This knee, we can rock it around a little bit, try and get it to move out of the way. With the back foot, tuck the toes up and stretch. Bring the knee up off the mat. Inhale, exhale. Really lengthen from the hip bone down through the quads towards the knee. And coming back up and out. We're nearly to the top of the body, so come down, stretch out the lower back. Legs deactivated, forget about them. Starting from the pubic bone, push the pubic bone into the mat, suck the abdominals up, activate the glutes. Lengthen through the spine, left and right, as we come up onto our elbows. Chin tucked, stretching from the pubic bone up through the belly button all the way to the chest. This is a safe position to be in because we've got our glutes activated and we've got our belly sucked up. <sighs> Big deep breath. Fill the rib cage. Exhale. <sighs> Squeeze the abdominals. One more time. Big deep breath. Exhale. Lowering down. Arms into 45. I'm glad that push-up challenge is over, eh, guys? So hands into 45. 
starting from the pubic bone, push the pubic bone in the mat, suck the abdominals up. This right hand facing the computer cocks up into, I don't know, elbow to the sky. As we push away from the mat, we twist through the spine, the body, and look towards the side of the room, stretching out the chest on the other side. That's it. So one hand stays at 90. The other one cocks up and pushes away from the mat. Twist the body. Feel it stretching the pec on the opposite side. Inhale. Relax the mind. Exhale. Push and twist. Push and twist. One more time. Exhale. Push and twist. And lowering back down. Head to the opposite side. So this hand stays at 90, opposite hand, elbow comes towards the ceiling, push the pubic bone in the mat, suck the abdominals up, exhale, push up and away from the mat, looking towards the roof, eyes look round, the body will follow, hold the tension, push the hand away, push, 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 inhale, exhale, Twist the eyes around. Push, push, push. One more time. And lowering back down. We'll just do one more little back stretch. So push the pubic bone in the mat. Lengthen through the spine. Come up onto the elbows. Chin tucked. Push back into child's pose. Feet together, knees nice and wide. Walk the hands out. Bum comes off the feet slightly. And then sink back down. We want to lengthen from the fingertips, right past the ears, down to the lats, to the pelvis. So inhale, lift up onto the fingertips, walk them out a little bit. Exhale, sink the head down past the triceps. Pushing back up, we're going to shoot one hand through the gap. So one hand comes through the gap. One hand reaches forward, one to the side of the room as we sink back in, dig the elbow into the mat and twist the body away from it, stretching out the back of the delt. Push, 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 twist, twist, twist and swapping sides. Hand shoots through the gap, dig the elbow into the mat and sink back down. Push, 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 twist, twist, twist. And letting go, coming up. Seated position, we'll just finish on the neck. Hands reach out either side, palms face up, twist through the shoulders, sweep the elbows together, push the elbows together as we push the hands into 90, keep pushing, push, 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 but on the exhale, we'll push the hands towards the ceiling, chin stays tucked. Keep squeezing the hands and the elbows as we push up. And 
and coming back down. Chin comes down to the chest, hand comes up and over, grabs the back of the head and pulls it up and over and down. Back stays nice and straight, we're stretching the neck. Slowly releasing. Chin to shoulder as we look around behind the room. Keep looking around, eyes go, the body will go. Twist, twist, twist. And releasing, slowly swap sides. Chin down, chin to shoulder. Feel the tension in your neck. Eyes look around. Twist, twist, twist. As much as you can go. Swapping sides nice and peacefully. Inhale. Exhale. Twist, twist, twist. Look the eyes right around. One more time, inhale, twist through the body a little bit, tuck the chin, twist, twist, twist. And releasing, let's do some shoulder rotations. Jordan just got shapes out of the cupboard. <laughs> Right, oh, guys, last one. We'll just do the wrist. So, thumb faces forward, hand comes forward and reaches and pulls. Inhale, exhale, relax the body. Swapping sides. Hand comes down, grabs the fingers with the fingers. Pull, pull, pull. And relax. Any questions, any complaints? That was good to stretch out the sore muscles from the other two days. Yeah. <laughs> Felt good. All right, thanks, Chano. Bye, girls. Bye, Belinda. See ya. Thanks, Chano. Bye. Be happy. It's Sunday. <laughs>